Pet and Ingwenyama, Emakosigati, Your Royal Highnesses, Councillors, Chiefs, Chief Justice, Deputy Prime Minister, Cabinet Ministers, Excellencies, Members of the Diplomatic Corps, Presiding Officers and Members of both Houses of Parliament, Regional Administrator for Manzini Region, Commissioner Generals from neighboring countries, the Executive Command and all ranks of the Correctional Services, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I am honored to be afforded this privilege of making a few remarks before His Majesty King Mswati III addresses this gathering, the nation and the whole world. We are humbled to have their majesties here with us in celebrating the 13th Correctional Services Day. Let me take this opportunity to appreciate and acknowledge the important role played by His Majesty's Correctional Services in ensuring that all custodial and court sanctions are carried out with integrity and professionalism, which has contributed immensely to the desired outcome of public safety. Your Majesty, I am alive to the fact that the correctional services, being the last component of the criminal justice system, are expected to carry out all custodial court orders, regardless of the limited resources at their disposal, in order to meet their mandate and the expectations of the nation. Government will continue assisting the correctional services in finding effective strategies to lower their operational costs, especially utility costs like water and electricity. It is gratifying that the correctional services have been able to apply several cost-saving measures to supplement their budget allocation through farming, uniform production, among many other initiatives. These initiatives continue to cushion the performance of our economy through efficient cost saving. Through your guidance, Your Majesty, government has crafted a strategic roadmap aimed at reviving the economy, generating wealth and creating an enabling environment for the private sector to thrive and create uh, more jobs. The roadmap, Your Majesty, has five key growth sectors and five priority themes assigned in implementing and enabling ministries and departments in order to fulfill the aspirations of sustained national development envisaged by this plan. The correctional services, for instance, has a huge role to play under the priority theme of service excellence in line with their mandate and in conformity with this strategic roadmap. Your Majesty, as part of its mandate in enhancing public safety, His Majesty's Correctional Services has since sanctioned the rehabilitation of Matsapa Correctional Center as a measure to strengthen security and improve humane detention of offenders in the facility. Government will continue to support the department in its endeavor to upgrade other facilities within available resources. Your Majesty, it is encouraging to note that the Correctional Services is an active member of regional, continental, and international corrections bodies where they exchange ideas and skills on common challenges affecting the management of these institutions. As government, we pledge your majesty to continue supporting the correctional services as it, it, as it implements its national mandate. It now gives me great pleasure to take this time to invite his majesty, King Mswati III uh, and Ingwenyama, 
to address this gathering, the nation and the whole world. By it, we know Pagat. Thank you.